India has launched its first domestically built nuclear-powered submarine. That makes India only the sixth country capable of designing and building such vessels. Wang Guan has more. The submarine is called Arihant, which literally means the terminator of the enemies. This 100-meter-long ship cost six and a half billion U.S. dollars and took Indian engineers a decade to build. Until now, only the United States, Russia, France, Britain, and China had this capability. It could take three to five years for Arihant to become operational. That's how long it will undergo sea trials. But once it is, nuclear weapons and cruise missiles could be launched from this vast ship. At Arihant's debut on Sunday, Indian Prime Minister Memohan Singh claimed that India is not seeking to threaten anyone by beating a nuclear submarine, but does feel the need to take all measures to safeguard its country and keep pace with technological advancement worldwide. Military experts say the launch of Arihant not only ends the nuclear marine monopoly by the world's five major nuclear powers, but is likely to tilt the delicate maritime balance in Asia. Some warn that India's rising nuclear power may propel a new round of nuclear arms race in South Asia. Wang Guan, CCTV.